uh, universities are largely set up for teaching and learning. Then after the teaching and learning has been done, it's also to carry out uh, research. Now for that, the government normally invests. Now the counties and the government on the other matter are basically the custodians of the resources we use, of course, having collected that from the taxpayers. And they also are very good source of validation of research results and uh, to a large extent the best probably consumer of research results. So if one can team up with the government, it is very easy to valorize a research, research finding. So for example, like in this particular case, we did not need to go and look for licenses. Uh, basically to valorize the research findings because the licenses were with the county and they were partners. So by just partnering, we automatically had the licenses and approvals uh, to carry out the project or you can say validate the results after the initial, uh, you can say, science. Now, <clears throat> as you saw, Turning research findings, which were in our publications and they are available on the REACH website, into a solution for the county, took several dimensions. First, of course, the, res the results, which we were presenting in seminars and workshops. Then immediately after that, uh, of course, it showed that there is water underground and then you needed to find how much water it is. Now to do that, uh, since it is over six feet, you must get government license. Fortunately, the county is part of the agreement. And of course, they were very keen uh, to have that resource unveiled.